So it's so funny sometimes to go back and look at projects that I've done in years past because invariably I see a lot of mistakes and things that I would never repeat. Like for instance, this the opener to this project, I'm, I'm using watered down acrylic gesso as a, to paint over this wood before I start an encaustic piece and that is not a good thing to do. Um, you never want to mix acrylic with encaustic. And though in this case it wasn't catastrophic because it's pretty thin since it's watered down and I don't use too many layers of encaustic, but it's just not a good thing to do. It's definitely not best practice. So do not repeat my mistake <laughs> in this case. I'm adding a few layers of clear encaustic medium here, though I've cut it down so you don't have to watch me do all of that. mixing white over clear sometimes because it really makes the opaqueness of the of the clear uh, stand out a lot more it's it's fun to see that contrast this is black India ink I'm smearing on the surface I'll be doing my shellac burn, but only once the ink has completely dried. This is a spray shellac that's clear. I like to use the spray shellac so that I don't ruin the ink by using a brush on the surface. You'll see it in a later part of this video, but once I do a wet shellac burn like that, I you'll notice that the surface is a little bit tacky, and I, I usually take a paper towel and just kind of remove some of the tackiness before I add any more layers of wax. Just another little mistake that I made. Well, kind of a big mistake. Uh, I forgot to fuse the white that I just added to the surface, the white wax. Since I'm doing a shellac burn, it wasn't catastrophic, but it's definitely not something that you want to forget.
this this video that um, is missing right here got corrupted so I'm sorry that it's not in there but I did another shellac burn at this point um, you might be able to see the texture of the lines of ink that I just added hard writing on the surface like that. I'm using an old calligraphy pen that's uh, just not really useful at all anymore, but it's nice because I don't have to worry about messing it up, and the effect of the calligraphy on the surface is pretty fun. Thanks for watching! Uh, don't forget to hit subscribe, and I will see you next time. Thanks!